How do I know what size wheel I have without having a tire on it? So that's a good question. Let's take a look at it. So if you look at a wheel, say this is a 26 inch here, 26 inch fat bike. If you were to measure from that side of the wheel to this side of the wheel, you think you get 26 inches, right? That's wrong. 26 inches actually covers from tire to tire, edge to edge. Same as you would on a car, it's a 32 inch tire, so 32 inches all the way across the whole tire. So instead of that, you'd actually find the ISO of the wheel. That stands for the International Organization of Standardization, pretty much a standard size for your tires that helps you find what size wheel you have. So essentially for the ISO measurement, you're going to pretty much go from the center of your axle all the way up to the very edge of your wheel right there. You're going to measure that, multiply it by two, preferably in millimeters. That will give you your full diameter of the wheel. After that, you go ahead and you go bead to bead on your wheel. That will give you the width of that, again, preferably in millimeters. And in order to find the right size, pretty much it goes width dash diameter. So that's going to be the order you put it in. You can either Google it or I'll have a link to a chart down below. That will tell you exactly what tires you can fit on your bike wheel and what's recommended for you.